Hey everybody, so this is part two of my birthday Funko Pop haul that I'm gonna show you guys today. Uh, the first one that we've already reviewed, and it was the a big amount of Dragon Ball Pops that I got from her brother and sister. And hey, we still have a lot more Pops to open up to you guys. And, and I have a lot of Pops to show you guys today. So before we get started, like, comment, and subscribe for more videos that will be coming out very, very soon. And we're close to the end of the year 2021. And we're going to be seeing what new pops will be coming out next year. So we have, so today we have a lot of birthday Funko Pops and I have a lot to say for today. First one from Entertainment Earth. And it's not that much, but it's actually a Funko Soda of Hermie from Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer. And I had another soda that I pre-ordered. It's it's the Fantastica Mickey, but it's not out yet. So for now, we're just gonna do Hermie. And I believe the chase is actually him holding a book. So we have the comment right here. And I'll be hoping to see if I can get the chase. Here we go. I'm not gonna open the box. Let's just Hoping to see if I can get the chase. Common or chase, whatever it is. And no, we just got the common. Oh well. But anyways, doesn't matter. So we need to show you guys the, the figure of Hermie himself. If I can get this thing to open. There we go. I need a lot of wrapping for these sodas. And here we go, we have Hermie himself. Uh, this is just the common Hermie. And like I said, the the chase is Hermie with a book. So I didn't get that. But I did. But I'm still happy with a common winner. So it's still not a loss. But anyways, we're going to get down to the remaining Funko Pops that I have. First one we have here is I got from... The box lines from my international mall and it is uh marvel's iron hammer and he's another one of the marvel infinity warps figures and it's just a combination of iron man and thor and there's a like uh this armor is similar to like iron man's and Th thor's hammer mjolnir Somehow fused into this. I like how they have the little flames on the little blue flames on that hammer. I, or is it electric? I believe. I don't know. I don't know much about the Infinity Warps, but I do know I, uh, that I like these characters a lot. So I'm planning to get more. <clears throat> but we got more figures here. Another one, which is uh, the second to last Bakugans that I have. This one is of uh, T. Guerra, and she is and she is Runo's partner, and I don't have her yet, but I'm having her on the way. So T. Guerra is a Hail Sparkle Gun, which is focused on light. So I'm close to finishing my Sparkle Gun line. Well, I just need to get his Runo, and then my set is complete. And the next one we have here is this one we got here is Horsey, the the seahorse Pokemon, and she's along with the sitting Pikachu that I already have, and the Charizard that is being delayed. 
but I still managed to get horses just because I am a fan of Pokemon. And I like how they had like a little stand for horses to sit in just because like she's a, a Pokemon that only works on water. So I'm really excited about that. And the next one is from an anime that I'm not familiar with. Uh, the, this one is of uh, Sesomaru, I believe that's how they pronounce this character's name. But uh, this one is from an anime called Inuyasha, which I've never seen the show in my life, nor have I known these characters. But uh, I don't know much about the characters or this one in particular. But I wanted to get to, but I wanted to get this one because of the nice design of it. And the next one we got here is two two pops from the Samurai Jack line, particularly the ones from the Adult Swim. So first one we have here is of Ashi. And Ashi, she's actually one of the daughters of Aku from the Adult Swim season, where Samurai Jack lost his way uh, for 50 years. And after learning the truth about Samurai Jack, Ashi is now an ally. And I do like how they give her the design, like a, like her the design of this character I can't even tell what but uh, another one we have here is Samurai Jack and his armor and his armor and this is from the Adult Swim season where he doesn't he has his armor on and he has a beard over 50 years It, this pop has a chase, which is where he has his armor from the the beginning of the season for Adult Swim. I didn't manage to get this one because I don't want to waste too much money just to get it one chase. But I'm so happy to get this character, chase or not. And we, and we're close to the end of my pop, pop barrage. But we have a lot of My Hero Academia pops that I was really excited to get. It was from pre-release. I was able to pre-order them. Some of the pops that, that were undesigned, that they're not available yet. But uh, the first one we have here is... It's easily one of my favorite characters of all time from this show. And it is Aerie. She is actually one of the youngest characters that I just felt sorry for because like she had like a terrible backstory where uh, a character named Overhaul where where she was like his like it was like a huge she was like her his lab part his lab rat just for creating like bullets for the black market and. She has like really nice detail. Like she has like a, a little dress from where she was released from the hospital, from where you're released at the hospital. And she has like bandages on her arms and her legs. <coughs> and she looks really scared. I feel sad for this character. <coughs> but Ari has a hot tub exclusive where she has like a school dress, but it's not really out yet. I don't know why. It was it was meant to be released summer next year but they didn't i don't know why <clears throat> but we got more pops on the way next one we have here is of uh, ryoko ryoku i don't know how to pronounce this character's name i'm sorry don't judge me but uh, she's actually a dragoon hero because i mean the name ryoko or ryoku is actually another name for dragons 
and they look she looks really nice like i like how they got her her like little helmet which is like so uh, which looks like a dragon claw and she has like dragon wings on her hair and a drag this dragon scales bandana which fits really well <clears throat> and then we have another one which and this one is of Tamagiyama Jiki. And this guy is a very shy boy when he's not in the hero business. As you can see here, this guy has like a power where he can be basically whenever he eats anything like, like for example, like fried chicken or calamari, he can just use the, the powers of these animals to make it to his own, which is, I believe, um, manifest. Because you can see here, we can't see, but he has like he has like a clamshell from like eating like oysters, and he has like he looks like he has octotail, octopus tentacles from eating calamari, and you can't see it, but it looks like he has chicken wing, chicken legs from eating chicken wings, and even a even a wing. So really nice detail for this character, a lot. Like they put in two, like they didn't put, they put a lot of details into this character. <clears throat> and next pop we have here is uh, Sir Night Eye, and he is a, uh, I believe he is the leader of Night Eye Agency. I believe. I don't know. I have to rewatch the anime again. The fourth season, I meant. And he's got a power of foresight, which. He can see anything, which is similar to like how films work. That's how he uh, he acts, and I do like how they got the, the little stamper here on his hand. Really nice, nice, nice small detail for it. And we have one last figure, and this one I've been saving up, and this is a. Uh, Infinite Deku with Airy. And this is where he Deku went all out just to save Airy from overhaul. And he like immediately unleashes the full power of one for all where he had to save Airy. Like as you can see here, Airy's a little smaller and whenever she's like inside Infinite Deku. And like how they got the details of Deku with his hair and his eyes. And a little electricity coming out of his hair, his body. They put in very, very extreme details into this character. Very, very strong details. <clears throat> this one might be easily my favorite, because like the big details of it. 